You know, it's an insanely stacked top five plays of the week when Shawnee golfer Megan Spainauer's 50-foot putt and Braxton Miller's six spin move both miss out on the cut. What? Austin Scott, explain yourself in this week's Layfeld Welding Top 5 Plays of the Week. The Alida Bulldogs head into a sea of green in Salina to lead off this week's top five plays. On fourth down at their own 37-yard line, Elida fakes the punt. They sure had me fooled behind the camera, fooled the Salina defense as well. That's Balin Stinson. He goes 63 yards for the touchdown. Delphi St. John's at the four spot in their home opener against LCC for the Holy War. Jacob Young Peter back to pass for the Blue Jays. He pumps and fires to Eric Vogue down the sideline and check out the grab over top of the defender. Here's another look. You really have to admire the concentration on that catch. Another great catch snags number three on this week's countdown. Parkway Panthers quarterback Justin Barna takes the snap, looks left and pumps, comes back to his right and heaves it up for Kevin Flogger, and he comes down with it. Watch again as he rips the ball away from Spencerville's Calvin Wilson. Mike Fell is known for having a lot of tricks up his sleeve, and he wasted no time showing that last Friday night. Darius Gordon hands off to DeMonte, boy boy Lyles on the reverse, and he gives it to Rico Stafford on the double reverse. Stafford back to Gordon, and he goes long to the one and only Ruben Flowers the third for the touchdown. The greatest show on turf puts up 49 points in their win over Marion Harding. Despite the great start to Mitchell Alt's senior season for Bluffton, he doesn't have the top play on this week's countdown. Van Buren quarterback Riley Adolph in the shotgun. He avoids one tackler, then slips past another, comes to the near sideline, stops, chucks it into the end zone, and Brandon Bell perfectly times his jump and comes down with a touchdown. Adolph absolutely took a licking after the throw, but I'm sure the touchdown made it all worth it. Just like every week, our camera crew did a fantastic job catching all the action. And check back next week for another edition of the Layfeld Welding Top 5 Plays.